All right, class, let's review lesson 16 of Wordly Wise. The first word is abdicate. Can you guys help me with saying abdicate? Abdicate. That means to give up the high office. So if a king no longer wants to be king, he will abdicate the throne. Assume. That means if I'm taking something for granted or I'm taking over or pretending to have. Bungle is to do something bad or without skill. Because the shortstop bungled the double play, the runner made it safely to first base. That's this. Dominate. This one should be easy. To rule or control or to rise above. Former means coming before in time. So I have three former teachers that were in this room. So that means there were three teachers in this room before me. I don't know if that's true, but it's what we're going with. Um, it could also be the first of two that were just mentioned. Both the crocodile and the alligator are dangerous, but the former, talking about the crocodile, is more aggressive. I will give you this a hint. It is on the test, this example right here. Okay? So, what's next is guardian, one who protects... So my dog acts as a guardian of my property at night. The next one is someone who legally has the care of another person. Sometimes you might need the permission of your parent or guardian to go on a field trip. For example, people who, who don't get have their parents taking care of them. It might be their grandparent. Okay. Next we have hoist. That means to lift or to wait, raise. If you ever hear in pirate movies, they say, hoist the flag. That means raise the flag or something that's used to lift. Intercept means to stop or see something. In football, you hear interceptions. That's where when someone throws the ball, the other team knocks it out of the air or grabs it when they're not supposed to. Jubilee. Everyone say jubilee. Jubilee. That's almost like the word we had last time, jubilant. Didn't we have that word? Yeah. Or joyous. So that's a celebration of an anniversary. Uh, kin is related by birth or by marriage um, or your relatives. Next of kin is the person that is mostly related to you. So if something happens to my parents, I am their next of kin. I am the next person closely related to them. Pardon means to forgive, to free from legal punishment. The president has the power to pardon um, the act of forgiving or freeing from any legal punishment. Proclaim is to make known or to publicly announce. Last few words here. We have provoke, which is to annoy or make someone or something angry. You can, make an you can provoke animals. To call forth. To rouse. Now, this is a little bit different of a saying. It's provocation. That is calling forth in anger or amusement. Okay. Rain sounds like rain, R A I N. All right. This means to rule as a queen or a king or to be widespread. Terror reigned in the streets of Paris does not mean dripping from a cloud. Okay. Not you know, condensation, evaporation, precipitation, not anything to do with that. Last word is riot. That is public disorder or violence. It can also be a great and seemingly disordered quantity of something. My dad's rose garden is a riot of color in the summer. So it's kind of like a bunch of color all over the place. Or if you're taking part into it, it can be taking part in a riot. Go ahead and check out 16A video when you are ready.